Hi everyone, my name is Trish Sornio, your friendly local scientist candidate. Uh, as you can see, I am coming from my home today uh, to you virtually because unfortunately, of course, with COVID, uh, we're trying to keep staff and, and volunteers home and I hope that you and your families are also home and well. And so I do apologize. Uh, this is just a simple iPhone video. Um, the last many weeks, you know, there's been a lot of uncertainty and, and anxiety around for I think a lot of folks, but uh, it's been particularly hard for me as well because I got into this race to champion science and healthcare and, and the things that I happen to have backgrounds in. And I specifically knew that there were a lot of weaknesses that we had in our policy making uh, at the federal level that was going to be problematic. And COVID-19 unfortunately has worked to systematically expose a vast majority of these policies that were weakened, particularly under the Trump administration. For me, uh, you know, I saw a lot of this through the work that I was doing and I really wanted to, to get our first scientists on the U.S. Senate Science Committee to prevent these kinds of uh, issues because unfortunately Americans are gonna pay the price for our lack of science at these federal levels, whether that is uh, economically, whether that is through mental health and anxiety of uh, uncertainty that's going on right now. And for many Americans, unfortunately, it is gonna cost lives. I humbly ask you all for your support uh, as delegates, especially if you are a John Hickenlooper delegate who is no longer going through caucus, you are not bound and you are able to support anyone. And while I immensely respect my colleagues uh, and the talents and the expertise that they bring in this race, unfortunately, the right candidate comes at the right time and we, we need a scientist on the highest level of the Federal Science Committee. There are zero scientists and, and we need to fix that more than anything else. Uh, it is literally costing lives. So uh, I really strongly uh, thank you again for coming out virtually today and for taking the time to watch this video. And I think, uh, you know, if you want to learn a little bit more, you're welcome to go to Zornio2020.com where you can reach out on our Twitter and Facebook platforms. Uh, we're happily taking questions there as well. And one last thing I would add is that it isn't just COVID-19. There's so many things from the scientific side that we know that we're falling behind on and we really uh, need your help in making sure that those are being addressed. And so, for example, we do have a climate change plan that is 12 pages long. It's on our website. You can access it there. It is science back. It's more comprehensive and more aggressive than even the Green New Deal uh, and a number of other plans as well. So thank you so much for supporting women in science in this race. Uh, please, please, please give us your delegate support to help us get on the ballot and make sure that we have uh, a voice of science in the debates moving into the June 30th ballot. Thank you so much.